For a lot of persons, the burden of paying for electricity may not be priority on the list of needs, but it becomes very important when they get home and there is no electricity to charge phones or even switch on the television. This report takes a look at how the hike in electricity tariff across the country is affecting businesses and homes. Sarah Yeko reports. This is Owodi Ajegunle, a suburb of Abuike to local council development area of Lagos State. After receiving calls from concerned residents, TVC News decided to get first-hand account of a community groaning under an inexcusable weight of high bills. A few meters from the entrance, we cited a banner with an inscription of a notice to an electricity distribution company. The bone of contention... It is what residents call overbilling, especially for people who do not have prepaid meters yet. Having electricity is important, but at what cost? Madam Mawao Falorosho, who is in her eighties, lives on Thomas Lanio Street, and she is the owner of this building. Like many residents here, she also has to contend with what she calls outrageous bills. Oh, well, not that thing, but what is for you? Adebewon it this is the same situation for the building next to Madame Falorno Shores. It houses many occupants and bills have to be shared. Sometimes 60,000. Now this thing we are going to suffer, they pay the money. But we don't go in the power office. They say no, now that amount we go, they pay. Nothing, nothing. We go, we not get anything for. It's our room. Nobody get anything for here. Where we say, but we they pay, no say we they pay money. We not get shop, nothing, nothing. They come, they give us plenty of it. It's too much. Make now help us. So we don't feel they do this kind of We don't tire. Out. I beg you. The church is giving us is very, very abnormal. Obnoxious. Let me call it that way. Asking a flat to be paying 58,000, 53,000 without manufacturing a candle nor pure water. I mean, this is killing. It is indeed a big problem for many business owners who depend on this power supply for their means of livelihood. I'm stressing to pay Nepal. We will charge, we will charge the uh, eighteen thousand. They remove nine thousand. They give us nine thousand. We have to manage that nine thousand for some time. Any time we will charge again, they will remove it. They will remove out of it. So that which the the, the previous uh, balance that we have before, that which is our debt, then they are they are deducting it. According to a report released in July, Ikeja Electric Company says it has successfully installed prepaid meters for about 400,000 out of 1.1 million customers. Energy experts are suggesting that the only way to phase out outrageous electricity bills is to get prepaid meters for all consumers, a task that has for years proven difficult for the distribution companies. Sarah Ayeku, TVC News, Lagos.